I'm guessing you guys like free stuff, which is why you probably clicked on the video. If you guys are not already subscribed, please feel free to do so right now. Follow me also on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at G World. But today we're going to be talking about a free Aaron Rodgers and also uh, the Kyle Fuller. Now, this is what I want you guys to understand, right? You're going to have to go through a lot of stuff to do this, but you're going to be able to earn a total of 16 Mutt loyalty tokens. Now, yes, you can use them. I don't know if they've disclosed the information about it still being available for like what you're going to have going into Madden 20, because that's what they did last year. Like You were able to use it to get players, but then you still got the same amount that you used in the previous Madden. It might be the same thing. Most of you guys are probably going to value the Aaron Rodgers over the Kyle Fuller. All right, so that's pretty much what we're going to talk about, but you're going to get 16 in total, and you probably can get all 16 by the time, you know, well, you're going to have to wait. You're going to have to wait because I'm going to go through all the weak objective lists, but as it goes on, they're going to reveal more information about this Mutt Loyalty program. It is drawn out, but it's very easy to do the things that you have to do, and I'm going to go ahead and show that to you guys right now. In addition to the free Aaron Rodgers or Kyle Fuller, uh, you also have the option of getting a full Ultimate Legend player, 94+. plus. Obviously, it takes less and less amount of loyalty tokens for the lower value of what you go after. Um, so that's pretty much what it's going to be with that situation. These guys are repeatable. So I'm assuming that this guy's going to be going for dirt cheap because more than likely they're going to make it auctionable. Else, why would they make it repeatable? So that would already, you know, kind of let you guys know that that's what's going to be the case right there. So when you go out of that, what we're going to do now is we're going to go to our trusted objectives and mutt level section, right? And then from here, what we're going to do is you're going to see that for week 40, week 41, week 42. So all these weeks, right? You're going to go through all these weeks. And then finally, when you reach level 99, which you have to wait until after May 10th, you're going to be able to get six just from that. So you're going to still have to wait. They're trying to make you continue to go through. You know what I'm saying? Like they're going to keep making you go through, um, you know, steadily staying playing the game. So that way it's like, all right, you know, pretty much what we have to do is we, we don't want you guys to go away from it. We know you guys can't stomach it, but here goes some free stuff. That's pretty much what they're doing. Okay, so now when you look at this and you're saying complete four objectives on week 40 objective list. So every week what's going to happen is you're going to see this here. Okay, now there's 11 things to do. You got, you know what I'm saying, five force fumbles, win 20 games, a thousand training points. Um, th there's a lot of different things that you could do. I don't like the fact that they have it set up this way where they have it where it's like you could do the squads challenges because I hate playing squads. But collecting a thousand training points and stuff like that, um, you know, if you do your daily objectives, you should be able to get that done. Winning 20 games, uh, this is probably going to be the easiest one, forcing five fumbles, because you can just go into a solo and do that. The 18, the 18 passing TDs, I guess, you know, it's a whole week, so you should be able to do that. The first down should be a give me. So look, this is what it is, right? The 21st downs, five forced fumbles, you should be able to win 20 games in a week. It depends, like, even if you have to just go into uh, a solo and just, like, kick a field goal in the gauntlet and get that, it's pretty easy. But again, depending on how many things you get from the daily objectives when you do that, you should be able to collect training points from that. I'm staying away from those squad challenges. 20,000 battle points. See, now they're forcing you to kind of play solo battles. It's like It, it kind of sucks, dog. Like, the way that they have this going on. Complete three daily objectives. So that's one. I'm going to probably do that one. Um, I'll probably do this one, number two. The first downs will be three, and then we got to obviously do the um, the touchdowns. But they're just trying to keep you as inclined as possible. Now, this expires at 10 a.m. on May 10th because they go to the new series, which is going to be level 99. I got to win 25 more games to get the free 100K. So pretty much I got four days to just torment myself uncontrollably and win those games. So we'll see how that works out. Uh, pretty much, like I said, if you want to do it very easily, I would probably go the route of going through the solo challenges. All right, I would go through the solo challenges and I would do things like, you know what I'm saying? Because like if you want the 20 games easy, you could go kick field goals, like I said before, rookie gauntlet, whatever. But if you're trying to get like, um, if you want the fumbles, you might have to play a full game or something just to like, to get that whole aspect of it done. It would probably make sense for you to do it that way. If you wanted to play around like, and go into these games and get it done like that, because a lot of the stuff I just didn't do, but these are moments, right? So if you go into the moments, these make it relatively easy. I'm just trying to avoid playing solo battles at all costs, even though this week is double the rewards. I Look, guys, I got to tell you a secret. I don't know if you guys know, I hate the gameplay of this game. Love the Mutt content, hate the gameplay. So it's becoming more and more difficult to have to deal with it. But like I said, we got to be patient, bro. We got to be patient. We got to tell ourselves, like, look, it's all going to be worth it. Because like I said, if they're doing it the same way they did it, in Madden 18, 
that means that all these loyalty token tokens that we earn right now are going to be available for us in Madden 20. All right, so we got to find a way to get through it. I may have to end up doing solo battles. I hate it with a passion, though, but I might have to end up doing it. I'm going to tell you why. I kind of splurged wildly, like getting that Ronnie Lott and just doing whatever I wanted. And, um, I, you know, he was go he's still at around 500K. He's a really good card, though. I can't, you know, really set trip on that, bro. The dude really plays good zone, and, you know, he has that nice hit power, even though he couldn't hit power a guy earlier and get me a fumble. He, You know, he has decent hit power. I can't really complain about that. But... You know, it's kind of weird the way that these games work out because I'm more than likely going to be rage selling Randy Moss. And I know you guys are like, yo, what are you talking about? If you guys have been watching me for a while, you guys know I love Randy Moss. But in this game, he's not Randy Moss. That That's what the problem is. So I don't know if I can fully accept that anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I don't know about that anymore, dog. Like, oh, he's just going to catch it right in front. All right, cool, cool. Whatever, dog. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Pick my mom's up too. Like, it was like Tom Brady just throwing a hot one right there in front of my face, man. This game just never gets... Oh, my God. He just threw that ball right there. like, And it was weird because I was going to try to pick it. But even if I didn't pick it, I wanted to at least try to get the fumble, too. But it didn't work out like that. It's all good. Go ahead. Throw it to him. Throw it to him right here. He's open. He's open. Right here. Okay, so they, you got sacked. I don't know why you wait for the sack, though. I really just got to get fumbles. And forcing five fumbles against the CPU is extremely easy. I don't know why these squad challenges are there. But I might have to end up doing those. Like doing the easy squad challenges to get it done. That looks like the easiest way to do it, to be honest. Like I'm, not, I'm not, oh, he just threw, he just threw it right there. That that, in all honesty, a lot of you guys that play squads, I might just have to just go. You might end up playing a game with me randomly. Like if you just logged in at the right time, I'm just gonna do it randomly, dog. Like when nobody else is, like I'm not gonna be streaming. I'm just gonna get on, and then you might end up playing a squad so solo challenge with me, bro. Like, cause it, like I said, I it looks like that's gonna be the easiest way to do it. So we might as well just go the easy route, you know? Fumble that. Okay, bruh, why why did he hit stick him? But it wasn't really a hit stick though. What was that? Why did he hit stick? You guys saw that? Like, he, you heard the sound effect like it was a kung fu movie, but then he didn't drop the ball, though. Why is that even going on? I don't even know what that is. But you guys got to remember, the solos obviously count towards the 20 wins. The 18 touchdowns, that might seem like a lot, but if you, you know, I pretty much score like three or four touchdowns a game when I'm playing online, so it shouldn't be that big of a deal. It just depends. But like I said, for most of you guys that don't play online anymore because you care about yourself and you love yourself, um, for you guys that play online and can deal with it like that, it might be a better situation for you guys to just do it along those. Okay, he's just gonna, he, yeah, he's just gonna, yeah, he's gonna throw it right there. He's gonna throw it right in the coverage, yeah. And then my guy's gonna dive, and all that stuff's gonna happen, and it's gonna be stupid. And EA Sports is gonna continue to make video games, and uh, we're gonna like it. Like that's pretty much what's gonna happen right now. Yeah, yeah, throw it over here, throw it over here. Yep, right here, right here, right here. Just throw it to him, throw it to him anyway. You know what I'm saying? Why is he, Jason Taylor? What are you doing, bro? Is this guy? Yeah, I, look, guys, squad challenges. Just do the squad challenges. All right, that's gonna be the easiest way to get it. Just do the squad challenges. Get those get get those done. Um, pretty much make sure you get that done. Oh my, bro, what? Make sure you get that done. Uh, you know, at least you know once every week. And then you're gonna do. You're gonna get to level 99 and get six. And then that'll be good. You'll get that Aaron Rodgers really really quickly, and that's it. You know what I'm saying? That's pretty much how we're gonna work it. Uh, because it's going. It's gonna be May 10th. What the? Okay, so pick that ball. All right, that's it. That's it for this. That's it. That's it. All right, just take the thing there. So we're gonna go ahead and take our knees, and we're done with this. But again. Aaron Rodgers, Kyle Fuller, like, I don't think that you guys should waste your time with Kyle Fuller, but then again, I don't know what you guys are into. You know, uh, maybe you guys want to deal with that situation, but the cornerback, the way that the cornerbacks are now, he's going to play just like everybody else. Um, I, Like I said, you guys might think I'm joking, but Randy Moss will be rage sold effective immediately. Like, he's on his way out. Like, this guy's been breaking everything. He's breaking everything. I, I, I really can't believe that I'm saying it, but you guys don't have no, yo, he doesn't, he can't spin and he can't burn anyone. So it doesn't make any sense to keep him, bro. Like, I got to get rid of that guy. I got to get rid of him, and I got to look to get rid of some other people too, but I'll leave that for you guys. You guys already pretty much know what's going to be. Don't go out of bounds. Don't go out of bounds. He goes out of bounds. All right, cool. Nice play. Can we just hit the knee now? All right, good. All right, so that's that's what we're going to be doing. You guys go out there. Let me know, um, you know, what you're planning on doing. Do you want Aaron Rodgers or Kyle Fuller? That's probably a stupid question. You know, I'm not going to get rid of Kyler Murray, though. I'm going to, you know, see, I'm going to rage sell Aaron Rodgers immediately because everybody's going to be, like, almost ready to get him because you're going to get the six, right, from doing Mutt level 99, and then you're going to have one from this week, and then by next week, as soon as they release the new objective, somebody else is going to have him. You see what I'm saying? Like, so you're going to have to be ready at that, like, 1030 time to go ahead and get it for the new week's objective. So, you know, like, good luck with all that. Make sure you guys are ready to go with it, but it's going to be very, very tough to get that done. Um, 
you know, to be ready to go to get to level 99 in like two days. But if you guys grind it out, I guess if you're on PS4, you can use that second, uh, the second screen app and you could actually play the solos from your iPhone. Uh, I don't know if Android has it. I don't know how that's really working out, but you could probably do it that way if you wanted to. But I think that what we're going to do, I'm going to just randomly go do the squad challenges. Let me just show you guys again really quickly. I'm going to randomly do it like that. That way it's easy for everybody. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to go through all this other stuff. So we're going to go, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. And then um, I'm going to do this. And then that's all four. Okay. Uh, and you get five series six trophies and a premium gold plaque. So I'm going to do it that way because that's four. That's four of the objectives. And then that way, even though I don't like doing squads, I'll just do it randomly with somebody. Somebody will be logged in. It'll be duos. And then we'll play together. And that's pretty much it. If you guys don't know, my PSN is GMIA. G-M-I-A, all lowercase. So if there's anybody on any other console, it's not me. I only do PS4. I want to thank you guys and girls for watching. Make sure you let me know if you're going after this Aaron Rodgers or the Kyle Fuller as soon as possible. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. One love.